If you think the answer is 1, you're absolutely wrong. I know, it looks super simple, right? The problem is 14 divided by open parentheses, 3 plus 4 close parentheses, then times 2. Most people instantly go, okay, 3 plus 4 inside the parentheses is 7, then 7 times 2 is 14. And finally, 14 divided by 14 is 1. Done. But hold on, that's not quite how math rules work. This is one of those problems where the answer looks obvious, but the logic is just a little bit off. And hey, my friend, only 0.5% of viewers actually subscribe, and I'm really trying hard to reach my first 1,000 subscribers. So if you like these fun math mind benders, please consider subscribing. It really helps a lot. Okay, now let's come to the point. So, to solve 14 divided by open parentheses, 3 plus 4 close parentheses, then times 2 correctly, we need to follow PEMDAS, which stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division from left to right, addition and subtraction from left to right. And here's the tricky part. Multiplication and division are on the same level. You always handle them left to right in the order they appear. All right, let's break it down. Step 1. Parentheses first. Inside the parentheses, we have 3 plus 4, which equals 7. So now the expression becomes 14 divided by 7 times 2. Now, this is where almost everyone slips up. They see the parentheses are gone, so they immediately multiply 7 times 2 first. But according to PEMDAS, multiplication and division share equal priority, meaning we go left to right. So first, 14 divided by 7 equals 2. Then we multiply that result by 2. 2 times 2 equals 4. So the correct answer is 4, not 1. Yeah, I know, it's one of those sneaky problems that look easy at first glance, but completely flip when you apply the actual rules. If you don't believe it, try typing it exactly like that into your calculator, 14 divided by open parentheses, 3 plus 4 close parentheses, then times 2, and you'll see the answer pop up as 4. And if you still have doubts or your calculator gives something different, tell me in the comments. I love checking your reasoning. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next Tricky Math Challenge.